We're about to find out. Okeechobee's got to go the length of the floor, too. So that in itself, they're going to have to go for the three here, so we'll see. Tomas Jasper, Alkesi, Clayton, Lita, Adamo, Jasmine Shanks, and Adriana Baker out on the floor for Okeechobee. They'll get a press by Jensen Beach. Here's the inbound to Baker. Ten seconds remaining to Jasper. Jasper, over left side to Shanks. Shanks, going up top to Baker, fires a quick three. Off the iron, no good. And the rebound, Jensen Beach. The outlet, Baker gets the loose ball, throws it up and misses it off the front of the iron. Oh, Okeechobee had one last unexpected opportunity. Baker, being very aware, picked up a loose ball that was supposed to be a pass to Galarza. And alertly fired a last-second three, but it misses off the front of the iron, and Okeechobee loses by inches here tonight at Port St. Lucie. Final score, Jensen Beach, 57, and Okeechobee, 54. And what was a great back-and-forth game between these two teams. And there's some very emotional girls out there on the floor right now for the Bombers who are just devastated that they didn't get this win. But my goodness. What an effort tonight from the Brahmins, and what a season, and we'll see if it's over or not. We think it's going to continue. They will just have to go on the road for the quarterfinals in the regional tournament, but we'll figure that out all over the weekend. Jensen Beach, a winner tonight, 57 to 54. The Falcons are district champs, and Okeechobee are runners-up. We'll step away. We'll... Ready or not. Here I come Ready or not?